Comfy UI can be brutal when you're trying to learn it. That's where Workflows Bootcamp and Advanced come in, both free and designed to make Comfy UI finally click. No broken custom nodes, nothing hidden, no time-wasted troubleshooting errors. Everything's laid out clearly, reroutes keep it clean, and there's a built-in cheat sheet that doesn't feel like homework. There is an entire step-by-step -step guide from zero to everything you need downloaded to run these workflows. If you're trying to actually understand Comfy UI, not just copy someone else's setup, these were made for you. If you're just here for the downloads, you can pause this video and go grab both workflows totally free on Patreon. The guide will walk you through everything else you need to know. Link is in the pinned comment in the comment section on this video. But if you want to visually see how they work, what stuff like Add Detailer is, stick around. We are about to get right into that. So just to clarify, this voice is AI. Last video, it referred to myself as Max. This video, I will just use it to speak in the first person. If it sounds weird, deal with it. V1.5 workflows are designed not just to use Comfy UI, but to teach it. Level 1 is the boot camp. It gives you clean, simple access to text-to-image, image-to-image, and upscaling. No fluff, just a solid foundation. It's also cheat sheet ready, with labeled sections and tips built in. Here's a text-to-image example. Prompt goes in here. The empty latent image sets size. Clip encodes the prompt, UNet generates the image, and VDecode makes it visible. Then preview image shows your result. Now image to image. Drop in any image. We encode it, run it through UNet again with a new prompt, then decode. You can style over real photos or reprocess AI generations. Great for re-rolls and improvements. Level 1 also includes simple upscaling. Load your model, then use image upscale with model. It's a clean output and runs fast. Level 2 has three major groups, Add Detailer, In Painting, and Advanced Upscaling. First up is Add Detailer. It automatically detects faces and refines them using a mask. You don't need to set anything manually, just hit Run, and it improves face quality on the fly. In Painting in version 1.5 is fully upgraded. It uses two passes, one for rough structure, one for clean polish. New nodes help preserve image quality across multiple in-paint passes. Load an image, open in Mask Editor, and paint. Type your prompt and hit Run. That's it. Last is Advanced Upscaling. Instead of just enlarging the image, it uses the Ultimate SD Upscale node to add new details. That's Level 2. Both workflows teach you something new face enhancement, smart in painting, and upscale techniques. You can grab both level one and two for free on my Patreon right now. Link is in my pinned comment. Here are some results made using the level one and two workflows. You can start generating like this right away. Just load the files and follow the guide. These images were made with Hyper 3D, a SDXL checkpoint merge I made and am proud of. You can also do anime or full realism by going to civiteye.com. They have all the checkpoints you would ever want. But personally, I use Hyper 3D a lot. It has that right blend of realism to 3D with highly detailed textures. This is level three, the Mega SDXL workflow. It includes everything from levels one and two, but adds a whole lineup of advanced modules. On the right side are the Mega Exclusives, only available to Patreon supporters. Depth makes a depth map of an image and uses that to make a new one following your prompt. Canny is like depth, but with edge detection. Open Pose lets you keep a pose and nothing else. Revision lets you chaotically mix images for strange and artsy results. Then you can take it over to Image to Image for polish. Blend Images combines two images to creatively make a new one. Images often end up with bad faces and eyes. Face Swap and Face Restore really solve that problem at low hardware cost. You also get a fast travel hub to jump between any section instantly. Each module has its own how to use note to get the ball rolling. Then a cheat sheet section 
that dives into the deep end of comfy UI knowledge. You can go straight to Mega for full power. If this video helped you out, drop a like. If you know someone stuck on comfy UI, send them to my Patreon, at least for the free stuff. And if you want to support what I'm building or unlock the mega workflows, you know where to find me. Thanks for watching. Stay curious. Stay maxed out.